starting my third year in my PhD doctor program at University of North Carolina at Charlotte and it is in the School of Public Health and I'm focusing on health services research so um, that's why I decided to look for this internship to help expand my experience and um, knowledge in international health systems and policy. My major is health services research and then my focus is in um, health economics and epidemiology. So using those two methods to um, look at health systems and services and Hopefully, my goal is to help strengthen them for the patients and their outcomes. I found about uh, Coratio from uh, the Health Systems Global. I have joined their group and used their resources and look at the webinars and was learning more about international health. And there was a link in one of the videos to Coratio. And so I clicked on it and learned about the internship. I, I liked Health Systems Global HSG um, because looking at the global health system, and being able to compare health systems is one thing I'm interested in to learn just how we can learn from other countries and their systems and their policies, which also relates to what I'm doing in the project here this summer. Um, but that's why I looked at HSG, because I find that very valuable to learn from others. Um, so my goal was to learn more about another health system and to be able to really uh, get in, de in depth about their um, policy and how it worked. So learning about Georgia um, was very new to me and different than some of the more common, I think, health systems we talk about in school, like in the European countries and of course like Canada being close to the United States. So it was a good exposure to something different and to learn more about how nonprofit organizations help to support and strengthen the health system was also another really great opportunity. So my project here is looking at the pharmaceutical sector specifically, and CIF does a lot of research um, and monitoring of the pharmaceutical sector here in Georgia. So my project is supporting their waves of pharmaceutical monitoring and looking at accessibility and affordability of medications for Georgians. And I'm specifically looking at uh, finding literature that supports how to figure out the facilitators and barriers to competition in the pharmaceutical sector, as well as transparency. And I have found through my research that uh, it is harder to find about transparency. There's much more in the research uh, about competition. But both is out there and what we're doing is we're using the examples and case studies from other countries and looking at what policies they've implemented and how pharmaceutical, uh, looking at competition and transparency isn't one policy, isn't one way to address it or fix it, but it's a network of complementary policies and we're looking at that and trying to see how we can use that information to help um, advocate for a uh, better system and prices here in Georgia. Being just here um, for the summer and meeting all of the other researchers here and seeing how this nonprofit CIF works was really great for me to learn um, f to see a different organization in a different country um, and I think this will help my career because I've learned again how to do more research and working with a different team of people, collaborating and communicating and um, learning about another health system and really getting myself to dive deep into reading about pharmaceutical markets and how the sector works globally even though we're still applying it to the Georgian system.